Well, the skills I think the retail um, textile industry are looking for is not what you read in a book. It's not what you've learned. Yes, that helps, but I think it's the confidence that the person has or the employer can see in the potential candidate. At Space at Tramia, um, what we look for is um, basic um, mathematics and um, English skills, very basic. I think that's where it ends, actually, at that point, because after that, when someone starts with us, it's a case of uh, the journey we have to develop and uh, their, their potential. The qualities that I look for is somebody who's willing to listen and learn, uh, a person who shows that they want to make a career for themselves. For young people to actually come and work at Basic Premier, the additional skill set we'll be looking for would be uh, ability to communicate, uh, ability to work in a team, uh, we need creativity, imagination, uh, after all, this is passion. The other skills I want to see is someone who probably has just looked at our company and has identified a role and probably says, I could fill this role, but I think I probably need to learn a bit more about design or I need to learn a bit more about advertising or marketing or how a machine works. Someone who's coming in with a bit of a proactive solution about how they think they can help the company and what skills they need to acquire to help us further. The, the skills that we'd be looking for um, would be a, an understanding of um, computers. It doesn't have to be that high, but it has to be a real sort of interest and an intent to learn and broaden their knowledge. I want to know what makes you special, what makes you get up in the morning, what makes what interests you, because it's, it's up to me then to find a role which, within my company, will both kind of get you excited to come and work for me, but at the same time, I'm kind of understanding where your interests are in life and I can coach you into a specific role.